and Ghost Funny Entertainment, where we get a stage, you bring it to life. I'm right here, right now, at Juno Park, with my man GGI. Pleasure, baby. You know, man, I'm glad you took some time out your busy schedule for real to come out here and do this interview. You know, man. Uh, first of all, um, let the listening audience and the people all across you know what the TGI situation stands for. TGI is gotta gotta incorporation. It's basically like we look at it like. You come from the gutter, you may rise, but in the end, you're going back to the gutter. You know? So, like, gutter, gutter. Like, okay, so um, how, how did you get started with the, uh, the music? What was your inspiration? My inspiration, man, like, when I, when I was younger, like, I used to listen to DMX, yeah. like, you know what I mean? Everybody listen to Tupac. Oh, yeah, yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Like, DMX, Tupac. He you know left me from the pit of his stomach. Right, you know yeah. what I mean? So, like, the realness in the music that I was listening to made me want to, you know what I mean? And then I realized I, I could rap. Yeah, know? yeah. <laughs> so, maybe, yeah. Well, right. You know, oh, okay, okay. So, so, how would you describe your rap style to the listening audience? I mean, you, to yourself. How would you describe your style? Meaning, what you mean? Like, Meaning, like, uh, what, 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 um, not so much a how you compare to other people, but what, what people would look for when they uh, listening to the GGI movement. People, basically, my life, like whether what I, who I am, where I come from, you know what I'm saying, where I'm trying to go. You feel what I'm saying? Where, yeah, like. Where it, what it is, you feel me? Like, I'm letting you know what's going on in these streets, you feel me, in the world, you feel what I'm saying? Like, all that. Like, it's about everything. It's not really about a bunch of shoot, shoot, pow, pow, you feel me? Right. So, right. So, so, <laughs> my, my next question is if you, your, your artist, your favorite artist, give me the top five favorite artists that you would consider the, the ultimate. Brand was of all time. Man in like industry. Industry first. Industry first. And then and then uh, the Baltimore City. I say Tupac for Biggie. You feel me? Like I like Mano. Mano. Mano out there. I like Mano. Fuck with Mano. And like Where's Belief? I like him. You feel me? Eminem. The white boy. That's my old brother now. That's okay. that's my five. Okay. All right, well, locally, uh, who would be your top five? C Note, Chip. Yeah, C Note. Uh, big Guy, made a Big Guy, that's my name. Big Guy. Uh, last Born Child. Last Born Child. Do I myself? No, go ahead. No. No. That's top five. Go ahead. Oh, well, okay. Myself included, you feel me? <laughs> right, 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 right. <laughs> you feel me? Yeah. Like, yeah. Who else I thought, man? I'll be back, niggas. You feel me? Uh, like, Jay McGraw, Camp, Eminem, Eminem Records. Okay. Okay. Now, my next question is, what, um, why, why, with those top five industry-wise uh, and locally, just sum it up. Why would, why would, they, why are they your favorite? One reason why they your favorite. Because they talk real life, real life uh, situations in that movie. Okay, okay. So, so, what's your upcoming projects that you're working on right now, currently? I'm working on a uh, collaboration. I'm working on my album, but that's supposed to drop like, it's supposed to be a double disc. That's supposed to drop like around February next year. I'm working on, right now, I'm working on collabs with 330. Uh, I just did the collab with Last Bone. Working on a collab with uh, Dude Nephew, you know what I mean, my man. You feel me? Okay. Uh, I got a collab coming up with. Uh, Man, uh, uh, man, man. It's a lot of fire. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, know, like, I, I know, got, I know, like, I know. I understand. I got a few mixtapes out too, like Wordplay. That's one I'm, and the next one is uh, Basement Music Volume One. Okay, cool. So I, uh, yeah, I appreciate you know what I mean. You coming out your bitch schedule with me. I mean, it's been a pleasure, man. No problem, no problem, man. Ghost Money Entertainment, GGI Movement. You get the stage, you bring it to life.